everyone, it's Lily Douse here at AIBC Asia 2023. We are here in Manila. It has been an incredible experience and I'm here with Punit Singh and you are part of PwC India. We're going to be discussing something I haven't spoken much about. It's AI. So why don't you give us a little brief description about what you do in the AI world and as part of PwC. Hello everyone. I'm excited to be at the AIBC Asia event in Manila. It's it's exciting the kind of opportunities here. Um, AI specifically, you know, the technology has been around for a lot of time now. Uh, it's uh, growing, and people were seeing implementations of uh, AI at scale. But what happened three years back? Generative AI kind of exploded the imaginations of people to bring some of these things to life, and the advancements uh, I've never seen. Uh, this is this is unprecedented. The rapid pace with which uh, new things are happening in the AI, specifically in generative AI, uh, unlocking so many beautiful things uh, that we could not even conceive uh, we could do. And traditionally, with artificial intelligence, whenever we had debates, whenever we kind of discussed artificial intelligence, there was one. a uh, point that everybody made it cannot replace humans it does not have emotion it cannot solve complex problems that a human can but this plot twist with generative ai uh fundamentally generative ai is good at solving problems that humans consider complex so the definition of problems that uh can get solved with ai are getting redefined and that's an exciting opportunity so i feel you know there's a whole pandora's box of opportunities are there Yeah, it definitely is crazy that what how much AI has been taken over all the conversations, everything people are talking about out there is AI. And then integrating that with the blockchain and something that I also think is really fascinating is the metaverse. How AI can be utilized in order to increase the pace in which we adopt the metaverse especially with not needing as many programmers. So how do you see, you know, the integration of AI and blockchain? uh you you took my point away uh so this is again i i i would want to make a prediction aibc special um these emerging technology trends be it the blockchain world the web 2 the web 3 the metaverse this will find themselves in a much better position in much wider adoption with the integration of generative ai now specifically you know taking an example of metaverse first uh and gaming what we see people used to kind of play video games in today's world there are characters that are be- being made which have a back story so each character in a particular game can be a novel uh, you know an author can write a novel for the back story of the character and you could spend hours interacting with just one npc non playable character of a game just talk uh, getting to know his back story why does he exist in the world and and it's magical uh, the art of possible with generative ai and the the marrying of these technologies so web 2 to web 3 metaverse to blockchain everything will kind of find new opportunities and um, this will you know explode in my opinion as well yeah Yeah for sure I think the potential of AI is even beyond what we could really imagine and there's so many different ways it's going to transform how we do exist as humans um and then I mean this is a topic I have to bring up is how can we have control over AI to ensure that you know it's not taking over everything which requires human input Yeah and again this is another point that every time we talk about AI we talk about you know is AGI real will it, uh, artificial intelligence go sentient um we when we are building ai solutions so it's very important to incorporate the responsible ai frameworks very important to implement guardrails that protect your applications uh for misuse for cyber security threats and attacks and uh, you need ai to protect against ai so cyber security companies are moving in moving the needle in creating these solutions wherein they are creating ai powered threat vigilance detectors to save from ai taking over so new technology stacks are getting defined new solutions are getting defined there is ai over ai this no like humans and i would fundamentally believe as humans we would want to be the master of technology rather than a slave of technology so that we get to define what 
happens with tech uh, rather than you know uh, the other uh, the other way around so again interesting times uh, and i'm really excited to see what what happens next i think that's the best thing about technology is that we are almost paving the way for how we want it to progress so it's down to us to choose how we want it to expand and be utilized but we just have to be a little bit careful that we're making sure there is still that human interaction and then obviously being here at AIBC here in Asia what have you enjoyed seeing have you seen any cool projects out there which could utilize AI So again uh, being here uh, and I'm excited to see the opportunities that Asia is opening up to spe- specifically you know Philippines I met, met a couple of people from the Blockchain Council of Philippine and uh, the gaming industry here in Philippines it's massive it's it's booming um we have our own set of uh, variant of the gaming industry in India uh, we are you know in the middle of some regulations and uh, taxations but having said that Asia is opening up to new possibilities uh in on all these areas and the uh, the fundamental difference between you know the, the opportunity of asia if i want to call it that is versus a developed economy or versus a developed country this uh, the asia ecosystem is hungry for adoption hungry for new ideas hungry for challenges and opportunities that creates those uh, you know beautiful ecosystem when we could solve problems challenges using these technologies and the hunger exists here mm-hmm. Yeah, for sure. I think it's crazy to imagine that in this area there's so much potential that hasn't been tapped into and now we really are seeing it starting to progress and they're realizing that hold on this the blockchain technology is the future and how can we incorporate that as much as possible into our businesses. But I also think we should do an AIBC in in India because mm-hmm. I think the Indian market is also incredible and also growing. all of the growing markets that would be incredible to take part there so that's this is a watch that space that it would be amazing but thank you for joining us here in AIBC Asia it's been a pleasure having you enjoy the rest of your time here check out all of our booths they're incredible sure thank you and just to uh, you know i'm i'm uh, excited to invite you to india and you know, you know you should definitely do a AIBC event in india uh, last week pwc india did an event uh, which is called the technology new media and gaming event we invited folk, folks from the industry from the gaming industry from the new age new technology industry and we invited folks from the regulatory side of things so that uh, healthy discussions could happen and we could uh, arrive at solutions which could be a win-win situation for 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 the indian audience uh, so yeah india is a beautiful market as well and you should definitely kind of find your way there That's all we're here for. We're really collaborating together and realizing how much the world can come together to get over all the different issues that we have and use technology to make the world a better place. So, thank you so much for joining us. It's been a great conversation. So, have a great rest of your day. Thank you.